So I'm so happy today because I am changing my earrings for the first time ever made. Not ever made, but for me, yeah. So, yeah, that just confusing little lady. So I'm going to be showing you a whole bunch of things about changing your earrings for the first time and all of that good stuff. So keep on watching. So what you'll be needing is earrings, backs, cotton balls, ear care, and eye drops. Make sure you get all those cooties off of your earring, your earring post. Mine's kind of in like a C, so you don't need the posts, but a lot of people use the posts. So, yes, that's what they look like. And they're little hoopies. And so then you're going to take your cotton ball and your ear care. And you can also use a, a little watered down alcohol. Pour it some on your cotton ball, just like how you clean them. And you guys have to clean your ears before you um, you start taking out your earrings. And you guys should go check out my video on how to clean your earrings. That's a really great video. And please go check this out after this video. And then just keep on wiping it clean and try to only hold like the the um, like the earring part and then kind of blotch it so kind of fold it in half like a hamburger and then blotch go around go around and like that and try to remove all of the excess like fuzz I guess you call it um, and then set that one down and then you're gonna be doing that but with a different cotton ball so keep on repeating that and I'm gonna give you guys a tip for the the earrings the, the post for your earrings that go in your ear, you should probably do silver or gold. They can both be plated. You can do um, stainless steel, which is another good one. And then the real earring doesn't really matter. You can go either way with it. But my earrings are plastic, but the little, like, like the thing, the post that goes in your ear is... Uh, Mine's plated silver, and yes, this is the real deal. I've never taken out my earrings or anything like that. I've only gotten them shot in, and they're still in. And by the way, I've been, I left mine in for two months, so about eight weeks. But the least you can do it is four weeks. Then six weeks is just perfect. Eight weeks just to be, like, on the perfect side. So this is what they look like, sticking out like a little alien. And then, in case... Your earrings do get stuck, like they, they can't come out. Put a drops of water or eye drops. Eye drops I would actually do better, I think, because they're much better. Um, you just kind of like lift up your ear and put a couple drops in just to kind of loosen them all up and get all the crusties out. And yes, so do that if your earrings is kind of stuck. So I'm kind of scared. That's really weird, but I'm kind of scared. So wish me luck. Uh, now it's time to take my real earrings out. Okay, girls, get a hair tie and put your hair up. Um, does you don't want any of your hair on, like, the earring? That would just be awkward. Okay, so what you first do is you're going to reach back into your earring like this and push the, the little pearl or the gem. Oh, man, I got butterflies. That's never a good feeling. Ew. Okay, and then you're going to remove your back. I'm super scared. Why am I scared, Vienna? Uh oh. How do you remove backs? Oh, I did it, and I did it again. Okay. Well, I guess that's a good sign. I got my earrings out. Oh man, I'm like tingly scared. Okay, now it's the second one. So basically, my tip for you guys is hold both one ends and kind of play tug of war in a way, and try to grip onto them so they don't go flying. Ooh, shoot, that one hurt. Ooh, ow. That's okay if it hurts, don't worry. And then, ooh, that kind of... Oh my gosh, my old ears. Sorry, I'm like not used to them with that. Okay, now get your earrings. Oh, I don't know where the hole is. I can't see it. Oh, there it is. Okay, great. Am I going in the hole? Ah, ow, ow, and ow. Okay, you gotta poke it through. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I'm wearing dangling. <laughs> Okay, so my tip for you guys is just kind of like push it through and it kind of feel, feel warm. It felt weird, like my blood was warm. I don't really get that, but it was warm. 
I guess that's good. I don't really know. And then you're going to press the little, like, back of it so it's kind of, like, touching the other part so it doesn't come out. But, oh, my gosh, I'm wearing dangles. So are you really happy? I'm like, oh, yeah, do, do, do. Okay, I'm really going to make sure my ears don't close in while I'm being so happy. And then my blood flows right here. They're like, Pew! And you just don't want that to happen. Okay, and then you're just going to put it right where the hole was. I don't really want to feel this. I hate that. Oh. Okay, and go in a mirror. Don't just eye it. Or, ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, just broke some skin. That felt really nice. Ooh, man. It gets, like, warm. It feels really weird. And then you're just going to put your back on if you need your back. But I'm just, like, using these dangles, so I'm so happy. <gasps> I'm wearing dangles, and they're not clip on. <laughs> And I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if your ears are kind of like getting red, that's completely normal. Completely normal. You hear? And another tip for you guys is you guys probably got pierced with your posts. So make sure you keep these. Don't throw them away or anything. Well, why would you throw them away? Sorry, Fiona. Um, so keep these because then you're going to put them in at night. That's what I'm going to do. So then these don't get caught and you don't get like, I don't know. I just, I feel much more happy when I put these in. <laughs> yep. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. <laughs> and please subscribe if you like me and my videos. <laughs> and I love you. Mwah. Yeah, yeah, yeah.